In this video, let's take a look at how we can reapply global settings to all of the question slides within our project, whether or not they override them on a slide per slide basis. So let's start by looking at Project, Project Properties, and the Question Options tab. In the Scoring tab, we have the ability to set up some default options. Now you'll notice at the bottom here we have an extra area but nothing's in it. We're going to come back to that in just a second. So whatever I have set up here will be applied to all of my question slides within my project. So let's go ahead and click OK. Now you also have the ability to override any of the global settings set up in project properties on a slide per slide basis. So for example, maybe we'll go ahead and take this survey slide open up the score dialog, override the settings and project properties. For example, we'll disable the re-answer feature and we'll click OK. And then maybe on another slide, a quiz slide, we'll open up the same dialog, we'll override the settings and project properties for this slide, and we'll change this point setting to be 8, and maybe enable timing for this to be 1 minute. And we'll click OK. Now, out of the five slides contained in this project, we overrode the settings and project properties set up as defaults for global settings for question slides with two of the slides in the project. Now let's see what happens. Let's go back into project and then project properties and we'll select question options. Now you notice at the bottom of this particular section we're prompted that two of the five zones or slides, the questions, in this project override the above settings with custom settings. So if I want to reinforce these global settings to all of the slides, including those that have the project override settings, I select force them to use the above settings. I click OK and then it resets the global defaults and let's just double check. So here we are in one of the slides we had changed and in the score tab it disabled it and then as well as this one it should have disabled the override feature as well and reapplied the global settings. That's all there is to it. If you have any questions on this topic or any others while working with Carbon's products and services please visit us online at www.carbon.com. Happy Vuliting!